What is going on guys, it is Candleman14 here and I'm backing up with another video today. As you can see, we are playing Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Simulator. Hi, it just dropped on Steam the other day. Logan's gonna be here too, so let's press enter and start. Ooh. I really don't know how loud this probably is gonna be. Um, let's design pizza. Ooh, that sounds fun. Um... Let's put everything on it. Um, there's no bacon, which actually is really disappointing. My favorite pizza is pepperoni bacon. They should add bacon. Go to pizzeria. Well, this is okay. Where are the controls? Let's see if there's any Easter Go pizza. Move shift. Yeah, I honestly have no clue how this game is gonna play out. Grab some pizzas. See how many pizzas you can get on one hand. Okay, we'll do that on round two. If there is a round two, that I'm pretty sure there is. Yep. I'm, is this like the whole game, just throwing pizzas? I might not let you get that, no. Um, I don't know if this is the whole game, but if it is, I guess five likes and we'll do another episode. Okay, that's as many as you can get. Really? Awesome. So if you guys do want to see more of this, if it, I don't think there's gonna be much else to this. I think this is just the demo version of the game because it's actually free on Steam right now. What is that? You hungry? Ooh, okay, now I know how this physics work. Stay there. You feed him and he slows down. That's one down. That's two down. Let's freeze them down here. The levels will probably get harder, so if you guys want to see me rage at this, um, <laughs> press the like button. This is really boring! Round four. What is going on? What? Hi. Oh my god. Did I break the game? Oh gosh. Do I still. What is going on? We can use the mouse now. Oh my gosh. Cameron, you're not on the phone, are you? No, I'm recording a video. Okay, just let's see. Yeah, let's look, do you want a baby? Um It's Freak Show Baby. Cameron, do you want a pierogi? No. No, thank you. What'd you just say? No thanks. It's not real. It's awesome. Begin tape. Leaving dead space. Three, two, one. The purpose of this tape is to test automated response times and reactions from vintage interactive attractions following audio stimuli. If you are playing this tape, that means that not only have you been checking outside at the end of every shift, as you were instructed to do, but also that you have found something that meets the criteria of your special obligations under paragraph 4. Follow these instructions, document response times, then safely secure the space before leaving. Upon sealing the room, you are not to return. Begin audio prompt in three, what do two, I do? one. Oh, I marked down the result. Like Document results. Okay, Begin okay. audio prompt in three, okay, two, okay, okay, one. Okay. Document results. Nothing. Is it like supposed to move? Begin audio prompt in three, two, one.
document results. Nothing. Begin audio prompt in three. Is that what that is? Two. The game. One. It's a new day. It's your time to shine. It's time to take your career into your own hands. You've saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. A gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. What are we talking about? We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. That's right, restaurant ownership and management. Something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and much, much more. Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee, such as atmosphere. Making sure your establishment has an inviting atmosphere is essential to bringing in new customers. Entertainment. Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. Bonus revenue. Coin-operated games and attractions can generate additional revenue during the day, which means more money in your pocket, ready for reinvestment. Health and safety. There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality, and we don't blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. But there are steps you can take to ensure you don't get sued for it. And that brings us to liability. Being a thrifty shopper is smart, but be aware that buying things on sale comes with a certain amount of risk. Aside from the daily risk of lawsuits, there's also the risk that something might be hiding inside whatever you just purchased with that steeply discounted price tag. Of course, that would only be a serious danger if there were something outside that's been trying to get in for months now, which we are not confirming to be the case. This concludes the amount of help we are legally obligated to provide. Remember, you are now the face of the newly rebranded Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wear that smile with pride and let's make some money. Okay. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. Okay. Ooh. Use catalog. Okay. Oh, so this is a tycoon. Let's get started. Okay. Oh, he's so Let's cute. Cash you had left over after Fun time, your Freddy, you're so cute. You're adorable. Great. That should be more than enough. Now let's get started. Let's get On started. your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. When you're finished shopping, click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between catalog mode and blueprint mode. Those animatronics, you like before opening your doors. To Bucket the Bob. When you're ready to open your restaurant for business, Mr. Can Do. The button Mr. Hugs. In blueprint mode. Number one, Give it a try and do some Can shopping. stand. Just put this in there for me. Okay. I'm gonna buy groceries on camera. Are you kidding me? Take the other bag out, Logan. Don't. That's for lunch. Here, there's more. Okay. What a fun way to spend a video, guys. Say hi to YouTube. Okay. okay, let's see. Let's buy the double stage. And let's also buy some cup. So we are looking now. Okay. The shop is sold. Oh god, I'm sorry about that. 
Okay, so it's just delusion mode now. Sponsorship offer? Yo, we just got a sponsorship! Some sort of drink company. Uh, from what kind of company? Let's buy this. Yo, look at that ball pit! Whoa! <laughs> That's the coolest ball pit I've ever seen! Is this like budgeted? This reminds me of, um... Just the balloon down there. Baz rating 25. So can we do it? Play test. Okay then. Let's put our ball pit in there. We get to play test this too. Uh. He broke himself. Oh god. Such a great sound effect. For this. Yay, we got zero! Woo! Dumb. Now what? What does it say down there? Okay, finished. Let's press finished. You might want to put your face cam on. I'll put it there next time. We're going to move the face cam next time. So now what are we doing? The next step to being your restaurant man. is now officially open. Oh also, yeah. That doesn't also, mean your job is finished. Is however, you have a lot of work oh, to do my. while patrons eat their pizza in the other room. From your terminal, this is you have creepy. Papers to print and repairs to make. Hell, Once what you've is taken that? Care of all the items on your to-do list, you can log off for the day. What is that? Money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash, so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket. Oh, the power went out. No, didn't. The only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Order cups. Now, onto other matters. Something to be aware of is that the ventilation system and your terminal are pretty loud and may prevent you from hearing things in okay, adjoining so 60 areas. In here, I guess, that will be a problem hot, if there is nothing in the vents. However, if you feel that something might be Let's the move the face cam now, actually. ...to protect yourself. You can shut off your terminal and the ventilation system at any time to decrease the... Um, I'm hoping to get a new face cam for Christmas, guys. Also, shining your light directly into a vent will most likely prevent anything from jumping out. You also have three I don't have any robots. The terminal itself. There is a motion detector, an audio decoy, and a Guys, this isn't FNAF. This isn't pretty. Oh, that's it. Face time pop soda. Now get to it. Simply log off when you've completed your tasks um, for the day. So, guys, this isn't even Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Simulator. This is also FNAF 6. This is awesome. Okay. What else are my tasks? Order supplies, I got done. Advertising. Print flyers. I don't know what half of these. Like, that's a creepy foxy drawing. I really hope there isn't. What do I do? Can I turn back on my computer? There we go. So why do I have to take the heat out of this room? And why is this my office? Just plant these flyers and menus so I can get out of here.
This is really cool. So I have $195, it's not bad. It's not very good either. Tasks, maintenance, unclogged toilets. I didn't even know how to bathroom. I don't have enough for an animatronic that cost $100 yet. Well, I do now. Clean ovens, okay. I don't know why we'd have to do this on the first day, especially replace bulbs. I mean, of course we don't want a light bulb going out, but it's the first day of opening. Like, you should have put in new bulbs like yesterday. Exactly. This reminds me a bit of FNAF 1, just going left and right through the doors. It's like FNAF 1, but it looks like... Equipment. Okay, I can't... System location. I'm motion scanning. If anything's moving in this pizzeria already. Let's log off. Great job. It looks like Great you're job. getting the hang of this. Like now let's just it. focus on now getting you through your first week. You through first There's week? There's a big party here Saturday. Party and you should five, view that day as your ultimate test. Make it through Saturday. And you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. We're gonna do this, guys. We're gonna beat this game. Comment down below what your favorite FNAF game is. Yeah, comment down below your... No, comment down below What's going on? Congratulations on completing Congratulations your first day. Your However, your day. job isn't However, over job just yet. Over just there is yet. another aspect to your end-of-day end routine. End is that fun time, Freddy? And salvaging so any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Things are found here quite often. And while we aren't sure why... What we do know Something over there is now. that they can Just be used for okay. parts. Guys, it's fun time Freddy! A much needed revenue boost much before much starting your next day. Of course, as with everything course, else as in this line of work, else, those benefits work, come with risk. Come the safest with thing to do is to throw it back outside. But then, you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it, and you run the risk of certain negative consequences. Huh. No, I have not. Should the item in question not be as docile? As it first okay, appeared. dude, should I salvage it? If you do decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. In the we alley. are sure of its origin. Sure of its it origin. is your job to complete the maintenance your checklist before claiming it as salvage. Or, if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Fun Night Freddy's my favorite animatronic. Proceed with salvage. You have chosen to proceed with the maintenance okay, checklist. Okay, button. Press Remember, control to shock your company him. Remember, taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. You can only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic and decrease its value. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. What are these noises? Okay, so I guess if he moves, then I have to shock him. Document results. Nothing. Begin audio prompt in three, audio prompt two, in three, one. Two, one. And that's what Matt that's for. Document results. Document Nothing. results. <laughs> he moved. Begin audio prompt Begin in three. Audio prompt in That was too dark for comfort. Two, one, two, one. <laughs> this is scary. <laughs> then that means he moved, that he still works. Document results. Yes. Document results. Begin Did he move again? In three, two, Should I shock it? One, two, Let's shock it after the thing is over. No, we can't take the risk. Shock. And remember, you can only do it three times. The next time. Okay, he moves. moved back. He moved back. 
document results. Should I say yes? Yeah. Begin audio prompt in three, two. He is moving. But what if I die? That's the third shot. That's the third shot. I. I only do it if I need it to shock him. I can still shock him. It'll just decrease the value. Maybe I'll get to keep him. Document results. Document results. You have completed the maintenance checklist and may proceed with the salvage. Well done. End tape. End tape. That thing is creepy as all hell. I love his voice so much. Well, guys, that is going to finish off the first episode of this. Um, lawsuits? Yeah, we got no lawsuits! Wow! Okay, that'll finish off the episode. Oh my god. Stan's budget tech. We'll check this out a little bit more before we end off. Ooh. Oh my god, there was a mask of that in FNAF 3. And that! Pig patch, do you think that's pork patch? Oh my god, guys, this is amazing. Well, <clears throat> we're gonna Wait, end off the video. Wait, I have to say something. What? You gotta subscribe to Cameron. Dude, that or was, else. That was actually a pretty creepy game so far. Um, guys, I hope you enjoyed the first episode. Get this video to five likes, and we will do the next one. And I will see you guys in the next video.